Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to add a logo showcase or a carousel for your clients as a widget for your Squarespace website from scratch. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So to actually do this is quite simple. And the first thing that you guys need to do is you want to make sure that you're logged into your Squarespace account as an administrator. And as you guys can see here, I have the, uh, the site builder for Squarespace. And um, what we're looking to add here is a carousel or a showcase logo for our clients. And there are a couple of ways to do that. And just to show you guys what I mean, um, what we would, well, where we would want to go is uh, elfsite.com. As elfsite actually provides you guys with the widget that you need through an embed code or an HTML5 code to import into your Squarespace site. So to show you what I mean, I'm currently logged into elfsite, as you can see here. And when you guys go to browse their widget catalog, you want to type down carousel or logo showcase, and it's this one right here. And show you guys what I mean. If I click on this, you'll be redirected to this page right here, where you get to configure um, how you want this to come out when uh, when you import it to your site. And it's a couple of um, um, companies that you can custom uh, custom make for your website. So let's say that you have clients over at, um, for example, uh, Nike or Adidas or any um, clothing apparel brand. It doesn't really matter. You get to configure it here. And once you've made your selection for the layout, like so, you can do it in grid form. You can do ticker, you can do carousel. Honestly, ticker is the most attractive for me. You can resize it even like for the logos and whatnot, or you can customize the logos even. And from here, click on publish. And it should redirect you to this site right here. Just pick free. Then here's the code. So we're going to copy this code and we're going to go back to Squarespace. Now from here, you guys want to inject, uh, or I should say, you want to inject um, uh, the custom code that we got from Elfsite using custom CSS or code injection. Let's actually try this one right here. So this one doesn't work. I believe it was the other one. Let's go back to co code injection. We're going to put it in the header, like so. We're going to hit save. And we're going to look for it here real quick. I believe you actually have to add a container for it to work, but um, okay, so here we are. So here it is. So it's not displaying correctly, but here's where you guys get to edit it. So when you click on edit, you get to um, add new logos to it, edit site header, like so, and import whatever you want, hit save, and you guys are done. So yeah, that's the video. So hopefully this video helped you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.